Okay, we back. We back. I don't really know what I have planned today, but something planned. Um, we'll see now. Now that we have mending and stuff, um, we should add that to our thing. Maybe we'll just make a house for the villagers and stuff. I feel like that's a good idea. I really should see if there's anything else, though. I would like to have that strider. But I don't think that I have. And see, all we have is respiration too. That's not exactly great. No, not I'm breaking. Ending. Death Strider. And it costs 15. Okay, well, we're going to have to get some XP, too. So I guess we could just use the Creeper Farm for that. I'm glad we got it back. God, it feels so good to have Elytra again. God. It is weird being able to see everything from this distance, though. Hey, how's it going? That's good. It is going. I need XP to do some enchanting, so I'm just kind of chilling. I don't really know what to do today. I'm thinking we're going to work on making a place for villagers. I don't know if I'm going to keep that one. I was just looking down thinking at this, and I'm just thinking that probably this entire, like, area, I'm thinking we're going to cover with stuff eventually. So, um... And, like, that villager trade hall it will be good enough for now, but, like, we're going to need... We're going to need way more room for villagers, so <sighs> I'm trying to think where to put them. I 
I just got an idea. I just got an idea. Do you know what my idea is? <laughs> the literature trading hall. <laughs> okay. We'll work on that. XP will be our secondary objective. I want to get on breaking and mending and all my armor is why. Before I'm unable to enchant it again. Because then we won't need to worry about armor for a long while. Um... Okay, first things first, we need to we need to make that a good spot first. Um, what do we have? What do we have? What kind of blocks do we have that we could use without having to go out of our way to go get some? We could just go get some stone and make stone bricks. I feel like that would be probably the most pog. Yeah, let's go do that. Oh, it feels so good to have Elytra and stuff again, like, I can't even explain. Oh, on that front, too. Um, good news. They, uh, the, um, the issue that was posted about what's going on with me and my world, as well as a lot of other people, uh, got grouped in with an even bigger uh, report. Basically what happens is people report the issues, and if there's duplicates of the report, they delete the duplicates, and they, they move them into the main report. So, essentially, <coughs> there was a bigger report <coughs> that was having the same issue as what I was having and the people that were in my report. And uh, they lumped it in with the other one. And that one actually had uh, a few replies from developers saying that they're working on the issue. Because they said that it's a much bigger issue than they had previously thought. They, they didn't realize it was affecting so many people, apparently. So. Uh, it might be getting resolved soon, possibly. I don't know how soon. I'm guessing after the, the next big update. The Warden update, the Wild update, comes out on the 7th, which is a Tuesday, I think. No, I mean, they, they just, they, uh, they realized that the issue that I'm experiencing, as well as other people, is affecting a much larger group of people than they thought. Because the report that I was in was only, say, like, like 70 people or something. And this other one's got, like, a few hundred. So, like, obviously it's affecting a lot of people. And obviously the more people it's affecting, the more they have to deal with the problem. So, that's good. Meaning, uh, it might, it, it's more than likely gonna, like, I, at least now we know it's being worked up. You know, there's no, like, doubt about that. So that's, that's good. I'm glad that that's actually happening now, because, fuck. The uncertainty of it sucked the most, I think. If we do get it back, though, I'm kind of attached to this world now. Okay, so question. If I get the old world back, should we continue playing in this one also? You know, we see what we're thinking alike again. Do you think I should do... I don't want to say, like, every second day, but, like... 
Should we do like an on and off thing of doing Discworld every now and then or something? What do you think? So, okay, so we'll put them in like these little, these little huts here like this. And that'll be a spot and that'll be a spot. I'm trying to like figure out the layout here. Yeah, same. So I feel like we could do something. If there was a way for me to differentiate this world from the other one, it would make it easier. Because the other one's like my main one-year survival world. Like, what could this one be to be different from that? You know what I mean? Like, what could we do with this that would make it uh, different? Like, is there something we could do in this world that we couldn't do in the other one? You know? Okay, so that's, we'll have someone there. We could probably have villagers in each corner, basically. Right? Yeah, I'm just going to put these here, just so we know this is, this is where they're going to be. So one there, two there. I guess we could just leave it like this for now. Okay, we want to do the minecart thing too. If I was on com if I was on computer with this world, I would get somebody to physically take this chunk and put it in my other world. That would be cool. And then we could have them combined. It's funny because at work today, I was literally thinking about like all the things I want to do in this world more than anything. So it's kind of weird that that uh, happened. Um, okay, so we got to move them. Oh, yeah. You can do that. 100% you can do that. Getting the villagers up here is going to suck. <sighs> Probably going to have to use a boat. Me thinks. Why are these ones facing this way? Fuck. Hello, Willowbean. We could use a train track to get them up there. What do you think? Do you think we should use a track? I feel like it would be easier than doing the uh, boat thing because we'd have to use water and shit and that's going to be a pain in the butt. Only problem is we're going to have to do a huge ass track thing on the go here now. Okay. I think we should be able to do it. I don't know if we're going to have enough track though. I need to make some. have to get the track going down to where they are so it's gonna have to start over here I can't believe I'm doing this okay.
to fix our path. Oh, it goes over it. I didn't know it did that. I thought it used to ruin it. They must have, uh... Changed that. I can't put these on steps, can I? No. So, it's gonna have to be spots where there are no steps. Well, the thing about the farms, like the creeper farm and stuff, is that we can... There are, there are ways around that, so, you know. Also, like, we can also do, uh... We could also work on the creeper farm, like... At the other location and change it, make it better if we really wanted to. Uh, I'm just building a track right now to get the villagers from where they are to the windmill where we're going to put them. Actually, we should probably uh, go in the side of it instead of going in the front door. We can just like break, say like here. Where is it? Okay. So we'll put the first guy here. Just need to get some redstone now. Um, redstone. My brain is not working tonight. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. They're already in minecarts, if I remember correctly, so... We shouldn't have a problem. Oh, I finished this season of Stranger Things, too, by the way. Everyone was talking about how there was a cliffhanger, but it wasn't really that much of a cliffhanger. I thought it was good, though. It's probably my favorite season so far, honestly. It was quite good. There's two more episodes, apparently, for coming out in July or something. It went where I thought it was going to go is my only thing with it. I kind of figured it out before the payoff.
mainly because I seen different actors, and then when I seen the actors, I kind of knew. Oh, I thought it was like two more episodes. I didn't think it was like a full thing. Maybe I'm wrong. You could be right. Don't get in the way, pig. I love doing this. It's funny. It's funny. Okay, sir. I will put down your thing. There you go. And I will put down your bed, too. We will do the classic thing of putting the beds under the floor because, well, honestly, it just makes sense. Um, like that. There you go, sir. Still got all your trades? Still got your... And breaking? Yeah, okay. Get the other guy now. Actually, we gotta fix the track first. We gotta make sure it's going to the right space. Sir, you are gonna about to go on a little journey too. Come on. I was like, we needed the space to put them, and then I'm just like, well, why don't we just put them in the fucking windmill? Like, we have this huge open space in there that we don't really have anything to do with besides something nonsensical, so like, it just makes sense to put them here, right? Where I just heard a baby zombie. Um, okay, and a bed. Okay, and now you have a bed and your thing. There you go. There you go. You guys are pumped. And I can get rid of these tracks because we don't need them now. Not at the moment, anyway. Is though. There we go. Because if we get any more, we'll just lure them in there. The zombies, I mean, and and change them in there. We don't. The only reason I even needed this really was to get them away from the location I had them in, because it was so temporary. Because we were so rushed when we did it. Tomorrow. Tomorrow and Saturday. It's pretty huge. Yeah. It is pretty sweet, isn't it? Oh, we gotta put back our jack o' lantern. Are you good, sir? You you good? Oh, I'm sorry. That sucks. Oh, work has been pretty brutal, so I know what I know what that feels like.
I can't believe we have 28 followers right now. Like, I'm actually, like, kind of mind blown because we've grown, this channel has grown a lot in, like, a very short span. Because I think it's, like, 11, 11 followers in the last, like, month. That's, I mean, for, for, like, a small channel, that's, that's pretty good. I think so. Once we get to 50, then it's... We just gotta grind. I'd say we've been doing this for a year, but we haven't been on Twitch for a year, right? So. Yeah, it is a lot better. It is a whole lot better. Like YouTube is good. Say if you're gonna if you're making videos as well as doing streams there. It makes a lot of sense, but if you're just streaming, it doesn't make sense. Yeah, it's only been a couple of months and the channel is growing way faster here than it was, you know? Than it was there. Even the YouTube channel is growing, honestly, because we're getting subscribers there that we were... Just people going to check out VODs and stuff, I suppose. It's pretty cool. I appreciate all the help. Just chilling out, playing block games, that's all. I'm only survival boy, play block game. say t hi today either no no I'm not gonna say hi come on a fluffy blanket for you there you go cats are sooks I'm telling you uh, okay um I was getting a lot of build ideas at work today <laughs> So, uh, if we do continue with this world, I do kind of know what I want to do with certain things. With the end, like I said before, we're going to do much differently than we did previously. Um, my plan is to have, um... To have a separate island we'll build ourselves for the farm, for an Enderman farm, away from the main island. The main island we'll still do something with, like decorate, but it's not going to be water themed like last time. Because we're not making the farm there, we can leave the Enderman alone. So my plan was to turn everything into like a giant garden or like a forest. Leave all the pillars, but I want to make them all the exact same size. And I want to have a giant tree on the pillars on the the end pillars like like the roots are like growing out of each of the pillars that would be cool or they're like wrapped around them okay so mainly to today too i want to work on getting um xp for doing enchanting i know it's kind of boring but you know we need it. <coughs> it's 
so we'll go to the creeper farm because that's a bit that's more XP than we get from the skeleton farm so you know ah God, it feels so good to have a light dragon. Like, you don't even know. <laughs> you don't even know how excited I am about that. I think the roof has completely changed now. Hey, look. Yeah. It's fully oxidized. I think it looks a lot nicer now it's oxidized. It is. I think, and a lot of people say that you should be able to get it earlier, but I think that the entire idea is like, it makes sense, right? Because it pushes people towards the end of the game. Like, you know, you beat the dragon, you do this thing, then you can get this, and then optionally you can, you can fight the wither if you want. You can see all the torches from all the directions that I went to explore. <laughs> well, the ones I did in nighttime, anyway. Is that a torch over there, too? It is. I wish the portal room was closer. That's my only thing with this world I don't like. I think. The portal room is a bit far. I think I like the, the look of the creeper farm on the other one. Well, it's like, it's uh, that way. And it's like, minus over a thousand, minus like 1500 or something like that. It's really far, so. Because, I mean, it's not that far in, in the original world either, right? That being said, though, we can fly there now. We don't have to, uh... We don't have to travel by foot, so that definitely cuts down on the amount of time. You know? Definitely. I tested the Super Nintendo after, and it works great. It works better than mine that I had, actually. So I'm pretty pumped about that. I was testing it with this game. You like this game, right? One of my favorites. Yeah. It's sweet. Um, tomorrow, before I start streaming, I'm going to uh, take a couple hours and I'm going to try and figure out the, uh, the Elgato thing a bit. I went back and rewatched the stream last night and it was pretty choppy, even when it was better. So... You know. Hello, oh, Tesla. So as for this world versus the other one, I'm trying to figure out what I want to do. Like, I don't want to do, like, a, you know, one day this world, one day that world, because it'll get confusing. I almost want to do something different with this world. To differentiate it from just, like, a regular survival world. Yeah, maybe we'll try that. That might be a good idea, actually. Um, but yeah, I don't really know what, like, where I want to go with it or what I want to do, so. 
I'm trying. I've been trying to think about it. It's like. I don't know. I don't want to stop playing this one now because I'm attached to this one also. You know? So, it's kind of a weird thing. This creeper farm's not working very well right now, is it? Is it the lights I put in, maybe? Shouldn't affect it, though. Let's go have a look. but I don't want to get too close to the middle of the water because obviously I don't want to run into a creeper. Because that would break the farm. Well, I mean, it could be one that we come back to, like, every now and then. It doesn't have to be, like... I don't mean, like, every second day, but I mean, like, maybe, like... Like, a couple times a month we come back to this world or something. Or... See, my thing is, is if I had something different... Like, if this world was hardcore or something, and the other one was survival, then it would make sense. But I can't do that, so... Um... I don't want to make it creative, because I feel like that ruins it. Um... So yeah, like, I don't know what I want to do. That's if we get the other one back. I'm not even sure if we're going to, so... I don't want to jinx it. And there wasn't even much spawning, is there? Hmm. Hmm. ba doop ba doop ba doop ba doop ba doop Maybe it is these lights. I know it's really far away, but... Oh, bother. Like, you can't see any of the trapdoors, because, like, trapdoors disappear after a certain distance. Like, you can see these ones. These ones down here, nah. See, any with lanterns. I never understood that about Minecraft. You can see torches from a really great distance, right? But lanterns, you can't. Like, there's lanterns on every one of those logs. And all down this path. Like, you can see it, right? But then, after a while, they start to disappear. It's a weird thing. It's gonna be daytime again. This farm is like not working right now. Like, really? It was working last night. Was it not? It was working really well last night, actually. Maybe if I change my render distance. I know that that's a thing. Let me see. I don't even know if I can do that, actually, without exiting out of the game first. So I don't want to do it if I have to do that. Yeah, okay. Let's change the render distance all the way down. This is going to look so weird. <laughs> see? We literally can't see anywhere besides where we are. What that does, though, is that none of the other chunks are loaded right now. So... We're literally in this one chunk. Like, five chunks is all I can load. And because we're not close enough to the ground, I can't load anything. So, there's only this area and what's above me loaded. Meaning, they have nowhere else to spawn but here. So, let's see if that changes it a little bit. I've tried this, by the way, with the other world and changing the, ch the chunk distance, but uh, it didn't really do anything, so, you know. Yeah, no. It used to only go up to, like, 20, and I think it's 27 now. They had to make the render distance a lot farther because of, um... Okay, see you later. 
<laughs> because of uh, the mountains and stuff that they added, right? Did I say last night that I have a show? Or have a show coming up? Another one? That's pretty exciting. Don't seem to be working, though. Weird. I don't know. Change it again, I guess. It's practically unplayable at this this setting. Yeah, I have a show coming. The 18th. That's so ah. Uh. I was like, what? <laughs> I was like, who? Okay, well, I guess we're, that's out of the question for XP. So XP would probably be the nether. I guess we're going to the nether. Let me put away stuff that we want to not lose right quick and uh i will also put this on oh just one of the ones that we usually play at so nothing crazy still exciting though um Yeah, let's go to the nether. We need uh, gold, though. We need a gold something. Perhaps I'll just wear this instead. I'm loving all the shows that we're getting lately. I'm very happy about it. I know, it's so nice, finally. It was rough that, that while there with COVID where we couldn't. Striders. I still haven't ridden on one of these yet. Ridden? Road? What's the word? Ride. Haven't rode on one? Haven't ridden? My brain does not work. I have no brain. We need to do a blaze farm soon, too. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove this entire pillar under the blaze farm. I'm just going to have, like, a floating blaze farm. It would be really cool. My music keeps cutting out. Is the music loud enough, by the way? Because it seems like it's really quiet. So if I get the if I get the uh, retro thing working tomorrow, we'll do a retro stream again tomorrow night. But uh, yeah, slightly louder. Oh, sir. I do kind of want to get some of these uh, trees too, actually. So we'll do that while we're here too. We'll do a bunch of stuff. Hey. Really? 
don't want a lot. I just want a little bit. Um, okay, so we need to go mining for some quartz. It'll also heal our weapons, too, or our pickaxe and stuff, so. Das is good. We need to put mending on our sword. We need to put mending on basically everything. You know what we should do? I'm an idiot. What's a good place to get XP while also upgrading our armor? I know exactly what we're gonna do. How do you see me from there, sir? Drop the blazer on, but I'm not gonna jump over there to get it. Yeah, we're not gonna go bed mining, but I'm gonna go mining for nether, right? Oh, this pig in. I wanna shoot him. Very bad in this case. Ow, 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 ow. I'm leaving. You guys are rude. Is that any way to treat a house guest? Why are there always so many of these lately? You noticing this? We're in like the worst biome for it is what it is. But still. Ow. Ow. Fucking rough. Um, I guess we'll just go down here. Just, we just gotta be super careful because we don't want to fall in lava, obviously. I don't even know what level it spawns at now. Does it still spawn at the same level? Because isn't it? It still goes down deeper now, too, right? How did you even get in, sir? Like, excuse me? to be at 15, right? Pretty sure. <laughs> Sweet. Works for me. Is there more? Or is it just that one? Oh, there's more. Oh, two more. Very nice. I 
means we got enough to upgrade one piece of armor. Um, let me just fill that in right quick. Okay, so we need to go down a few more usually. Ideally. It can spawn at any level. It's just that it's more commonly found at uh, 15. So here. Hopefully we find some other ores too so that we can heal our shit. You know the drill. I just do this shit. Speaking of that way. Who's your favorite character on Stranger Things? Dustin. <laughs> yeah. He's a good character. Okay, no self, because we're not going that way anymore. So we gotta line up a little bit, because we gotta see if there's any more of that. That's sweet netherite. I can see any. Um. Probably between, uh, you're probably already going to know my answer. Probably either, I'm going to say Robin. I think Robin's my favorite character. Steve's cool too, though. They're all really good actors, too. Well, I guess we're not going that way. There's not much that way. I guess we should go this way.
Don't go there. Got it. Yay, more gravel. Wonderful. I love gravel so much. I just love it. It's just like my favorite. It's nothing I like more than gravel. Right, sorry. Of course, there's another rack. There's so much another rack. Okay, a lot of one, one pieces of it. I feel like this this season is super Nightmare on Elm Street inspired, like really, really Nightmare on Elm Street inspired because like there's just so many parallels. Like even the villain is really, like he has the one claw hand and shit, right? Also, we already have a character named Nancy and everything, so, like, you know. Not to mention that, like, like Freddy Krueger's actor is in the show, like, right? Yeah, the music, definitely. Freddy Krueger's actor is in the show, right? In case you didn't know. Yeah. They do. But even, w even when they go to see uh, Victor in like the asylum or whatever. And he's just sitting there like at the, the table or whatever. And, and he's scraping his nails on the table. And the noise it was making, I was like, ah, oh, bro, bro. All, all this season is making me want, is making me want another Nightmare on Elm Street movie with him. Just one more. The dude's getting old, like, come on. Oh, and he also said it, that his world is like a waking nightmare, and I was like, ha <laughs> ha. It's so cool. It's like my favorite horror movie series. On, like, I'm sorry. It's just, it's so good. It's cheesy. And a lot of the jokes are very, uh, immature. For lack of a better word. Um, but it's a very good, uh, I, I always liked it. I always will. Robert Englund is, like, such an underrated actor, too. He's really good. He was even really good as that character. Like, I was like, man, you know? Trying to get enough for two pieces. Um, we got enough for one, and we have one piece, so. Like that's one move. That's one horror series that hasn't been rebooted properly either, right? Like every other horror movie series has gotten at least a decent reboot, right? Like even Friday the Thirteenth did like that Rob Zombie one that was wasn't the best, but it was okay. Um, 
that Halloween had a reboot recent, more recently. Right? So, like, I don't know. I feel like it deserves it. It's, it's an icon. But I think a lot of people don't want it to come back because of, uh, reasons. The subject matter of it, I guess, and a lot of the jokes are kind of outdated for today's climate. Like, it's a very 80s character. It's not like the other horror movies either, right? Because other horror movies, like... Like... M Michael Myers and, like, Jason, like, they don't have... Personalities, you know what I mean? They're kind of, like, silent killers. So, like, if you're doing... Nightmare on Elm Street, like, Freddy has a definite character. You know, so I feel like... It's probably a harder one to do. Because if they don't get the original actor, it's not going to be the same. It's like the last time when they tried to remake it, it wasn't the same. And that wasn't the actor's fault, in my opinion. That was the writing. The writing for that movie was horrible. The script for that movie was terrible. I was all down for a remake. I don't care. I mean, even Chucky got like a good revival, you know? Child's Play is huge. Well, it was just a remake of the first one, but it was, like, not as good. But I feel like if they did one more sequel, just one more sequel with the original actor, Robert Englund, and, um, even, like, because, uh, Heather Langenkamp is still, is still alive and well and stuff and doing stuff, right? She's Nancy. She's, um, she does special effects for horror movies, right? That's what she got into after... Ow. Ow. Jump up and down. Okay. Yeah, she does special effects for horror movies now. That's what she got into after she, uh... Stopped being in that series. I'm pretty sure she's in a few things, but not a whole lot. Okay, we're not going that way. But, like, what, as I was getting into, you could have her come back, obviously. She you can't not have Nancy. Like, she's key. They could even have cameos from some of the other actors. Like, even if they didn't want, like, a major role, you know? Like, they could put them in just in some minor roles or something. It'd be kind of cool to see them come back. Bring back Johnny in a cameo. Mr. Johnny Depp. If he still has a career. <laughs> I think he cameoed in like the third movie. On like a TV or something. In the background. It was like a news report or something and he was in it. Uh, bring back, what's her name? From the third movie, she's the main character. She wasn't in it after that, even though she was supposed to be. Oh, God, that actor, what, actress, what is her name? Patricia Arquette. There's a lot of really good actors have been in that movie series, I guess. There's a lot of, uh, a lot of big actors. I think we're good. We can go back now. We have enough for uh, for two upgrades. But we should probably try, maybe, because I have one piece at the thing. So if we get three more pieces, then we could have enough for three. So maybe we'll just go, like, a different direction here.
I don't know, I just feel like that series is kind of forgotten and it sucks because it was so good. I have a lot of friends that have never seen a Nightmare on Elm Street movie. Obviously, they're younger than me, but, you know. I mean, come on. My mother would not let me watch those movies when I was a kid. Because of the humor, it was very, uh... Dirty, I guess. She didn't care about the gore or anything like that. Because I've seen plenty of that stuff. I think that's a lot of the reason, too, why that series has a hard time coming back. I feel like with the way, uh, how, how do I, <laughs> with the way things are nowadays, I feel like it doesn't really fit in that, uh, I don't think that, like, a younger audience would take it as jokingly, you know? I mean, I could be wrong, but... Then again, though, like, that's not really an excuse because Child's Play is really, like, big right now. And Child's Play has a lot of that same kind of humor. And the TV show does, too. So, I don't know. There's, a way, there's ways around that stuff. I mean, you don't have to change it completely. But there are ways to, you know, fit it in to today's climate. I mean, he played, uh, he came back as Freddy Krueger in a TV show more recently in the last couple of years. I forget what the TV show was, but it was like a little cameo, but he was as the character and it was so cool. Obviously, Freddy's a little bit more, uh, aged <laughs> and slightly bigger, but Freddy had that like dad bod. I don't know, I just feel like that series is, is cool, and, and, like, a lot of, like, the horror-type kill stuff, like, you can do a lot of really creative stuff with that character, right? Compared to, say, other characters. That being said, though, if they made another one, I don't know how good it would be without Wes Craven, because Wes Craven's not alive anymore. It's kind of, you know, it's kind of like how they made new Scream movies, but, you know, like, they're, mm, <laughs> they're not great. Man, this stream is flying by. I only got like 2 XP. <laughs> what, Scream? Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. Definitely. Why is my music not on right now? It would be nice if it would turn. There we go. <laughs> Why did I do that? I want that one, not that. Oh, the last one? Yeah. 
well, the last one didn't have him directing it either, so, you know. Um. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what they could do. I mean, they could probably do something more meta. Have you ever seen New Nightmare? Like the one that came out in the 90s before Scream? Where it was like the actors were being plagued by the character instead of the instead of it being like a movie like it was like oh well they're he's plaguing them in real life now bro what is going on with this music tonight like could you not I know. that's one of my favorite ones freddy's really actually legitimately scary in that movie well, it's not really freddy though it's a demon i guess taking that form but like still I, I like that plot i thought that was cool why don't they do something else like that they could totally do something cool with that right am i right or am i right where is am i stupid yes yes i am okay one two three oh my god bruh bruh so annoying okay um we need to cook this yeah i don't know i don't know what they could do but it would be cool i do have the collection i have it over here actually because i was gonna watch them again i have a dvd collection i don't have it on blu-ray the Blu-ray collections never look as good as the DVD. Like, the boxes were just so much nicer. You see? It's got all the movies in it. It's even got the glasses, you know? Because the... The one that's 3D glass, the one that was in 3D. Oh my god. This music... You know, the 3D ones. They're like branded too. See, they have the logo on them. It's cool. It is a cool box set. I got it at a thrift store. <laughs> Surprising the things that you can find at a thrift store, I'm telling you. I'm wearing my elytra, am I not? Okay. I was gonna say. That was a good landing. Let's see if any creepers spawn now. We haven't really done much this stream, but we've we're getting there. I really like the box art too. Um, I'll show you. It's got, like, the artwork on the front, right? Like that. But then, like, it has, like, the thing where the spines make up something when you put them all together or whatever, right? Like that. Yeah, it's cool. The only thing is the third movie in it is really scratched up. I have it separate in a different uh, box, but the disc is super scratched, so... I guess somebody didn't like the third movie. Even though the third movie is debatably the best one. In my opinion, it would go Nightmare on Elm Street 1, then Nightmare on Elm Street 3, then probably... I need to look. Then probably New Nightmare. Um, then probably 4, 5, and 2 last. No... Six and then two last. Two is the worst one in my opinion. It's just such a weird concept where he's like inhabiting the other character. It's like body. I don't know. It's weird. And like love defeats him. It's like, oh. The first one's my favorite because it's actually scary at the beginning. There's a lot of really cool imagery in it. The third one is just a really good like action horror movie. Um... And I like all the characters in that movie. And a lot of the kills are really creative. Um, 
New Nightmare is a really good concept. It's not exactly the best movie, but it's it's still good. Uh, four is good. Five, it starts to go downhill really bad. And then six, the Freddy's Dead one is pretty rough to watch. It's probably my least watched one, honestly. And then the second one. I say the second one's the worst one, but... Uh... The Freddy's Dead one I, I don't watch very much either. Whatever one has... Because he has one where he kills somebody in a video game too, right? And he has the power glove, but it's his claw. But it's it has the power glove. It's so fucking cool. <laughs> I don't know if you've ever noticed that. Yeah, it's cool. I just love all of them. There's so many creative ones in, the, in those movies. I usually AFK when I'm doing this. I'm just going to AFK and talk. And we'll see if it if they spawn a little bit better. The other ones I have, I have one of them here. The other ones I have are in like these other cases. They're like these red ones. But they don't have like the original artwork on the cover, which sucks. Because the original artwork for the Elm Street movies is so cool. I wonder who the artist is. I'm not sure. But I love it. Third one. That's what the vi like the video game for a Nintendo is the first movie. Like it's just called Nightmare on Elm Street, but it's clearly based on the third movie, right? Because like when you go to sleep in it, you get like superpowers and shit, and like that's pretty much what that movie is. That's another thing they could easily do with that series. Like imagine the cool video games they could make. So much potential for a series, and they don't do anything with it. Always bothers me more than anything. Like, who wants the rights to that? It would still be... Is it... It's New Line Cinema, so, like, who... Do they still exist? I feel like they don't. A lot of them are just dying, which makes me think I should put something here to stop them from dying. Like, would carpets break the fall? I don't know. I feel like it wouldn't. That's good. I need to do that tomorrow, once I get back from going out. Yeah, I was thinking honey. Honey or wool, I think wool also breaks fall. We'd have to move the uh, droppers down one, though. Yeah, slime would be a bit much, though, because the last thing I need is bouncing creepers. Enderman is one thing, but bouncing explosive things. Go boom boom. Facts. 
facts. Okay. Um, let me see now. You've been slimed. Paper. I need a lot of paper. And we need gum powder. Make some uh, double ones. They're never in the recipe book, which always bothers me. Because it's literally just this. See, and then you get flake duration too. Which are so much better. So much better. I think next thing we need to get is a totem too. Getting totems would be uh, really fucking helpful. Man, this guy's always here. Is he still selling the same junk? Uh -huh. Yes, of course he is. Why would why wouldn't he be selling junk? It just would make sense, right? What did I name the donkey again? Wilfred, right? <laughs> right. That's funny. I bet if I have flight duration threes, it would get me up here, like, immediately. I could put a ladder going up here, but, like, now that I have a light tread, it's kind of unnecessary. I was, I was thinking about doing something. You know how we have the, uh... Yeah, but I mean, it's kind of cool that it's floating, though. You know how we have the, uh, lightning rod on this pole? And I wanted to do something more with it to make it look less ugly. I was thinking, what if we did, like, a giant ball of, like... Redstone, um, lamps. And whenever it gets struck by lightning, it, the giant ball, like turns on it like lights up well now it works why is it working way better all of a sudden <laughs> like what the fuck oh do i see one block on my house that's not done it's right there i thought the whole thing was done why did it whatever Oh, my neck is still killing me. The other night I slept a weird way. I got a new pillow, see, and, I, and I'm not used to it. And I slept a weird way, and now it's like... It's still a bit sore, but it's not as bad as it was. It's a nice pillow though, it's like this Serta one, but it's like, it, it's always cold, like it stays cold. It's really good. I love Serta pillows. <laughs> right? And we needed level 15 to do the enchant I wanted. So we'll probably need more than that, actually. Do 
Do you? You're one of those people that has a sofa with, like, 16 pillows on it. Do you have, like, the stupid beds with, like, the fucking 18 million pillows on them? <laughs> I don't mind sofa pillows, but I just find, like, when there's multiple people over, they're really annoying at that point. Okay. You're not cray-cray for pillows. I have a Technoblade pillow. <laughs> Surprisingly. That's what one of those U2s was. Where's that jam? This is a jam too, though. This one? It's a vivid light. Is this one? I like this one. I like some of these like synth songs. They're really like 80s sounding. Even they're new. Um. Right now I have two because I have my old one that I still kind of use because it's really flat. And I have the other one on top. The only reason I did that was because I my neck hurt after using the new one. So I feel like I'm just not used to the... Like, the new one I got is more, like, fluffy. And the old one that I got is, like, a really skinny, flat one. But I, I usually, like, fold it up or something, right, when I sleep. So, yeah. Yes, bye. There's only 18 the last time I checked. <laughs> oh, I might play some Star Trek Online tomorrow. Not on stream, but I might just play some tomorrow. Me either. Oh. We show on the 18th, and it's... That Sega, that Sonic game comes out on the 23rd, because that's Sonic's birthday. And then my birthday. And then vacation. I know, right? Somebody today was like, how did you get your vacation? Like, how did you get vacation? You haven't even been here a full year yet. And I was just like... I told him I'd quit if I didn't get it. <laughs> That shit works really well sometimes. You yeah, know? No, we should fly over there. And fill out this part of the map. Just so that we, we at least have this full map filled out. Uh, late... July, I think, if I remember correctly. Watch the world size go up after this. Hopefully they fix the bug. I didn't even know there was like an ice mountain over here. Interesting. Okay, now I just need to go this way. I don't know either, but that's not my problem. <laughs> Quite frankly. 
I'm not worried about it because it's not my problem. That is an ish them. Not an ish me. Okay, I'll go this way. Almost got. Oh, I do I hear phantoms? I do, don't I? No, I bet. Uh, I mean, it sucks now, but it might not suck. You never know. I mean, it might. It might suck horribly, but, you know. I'm not helping, am I? Who's <laughs> like, shut up, Kyle. I mean, it might. It could be. The, it could suck horribly, like I said. But like, you never know. You know. Sometimes things that seem bad turn out good. Most times, not. But <laughs> sometimes. Okay. Let's go back to sleep. Because these phantoms are taking me off. Uh, yes. How are there monsters nearby? See, on my ceiling. Are you kidding me? Are you, like, actually kidding me? Bruh. Bruh. They're mad at me because I, cause I want to sleep. Because I haven't slept. And then I go to sleep and then they won't leave me alone. It's an issue. This is an issue. Could you guys, like, please... Screw off? Bruh. Bruh. Look at them. They're so annoying. Bruh, how are they nearby? There must be one, like, stuck in my roof or something. Like, yeah, right there, look. That's what it is. We'll go and kill him real quick. Just right quick. Gotta take him out. There we go. Problem solved. Oh, the bat things. Yeah. I can see that. Did he drop a membrane? He did not. Lame. Lame. Okay, let's do this again now. Let me go up here. Let me go bam. Here we go. Bam. And bam. We got a whole bunch. Uh, fixing Elytra if you don't have mending. Bruh, this is so annoying. Why does it keep doing this? Also, I need to take some stuff out of here that doesn't need to be in here. Like this compass. Uh, take out these potions. We'll leave that in there. We'll leave that. Take out these. Yeah. It's really good if you get stuck somewhere. Actually, you know what? We need... These don't need to be... Let me just do that right quick. Let's just take all of this stuff out and we'll put in the stuff that we want there first. Mm -hmm. 
we need to make a spot for that egg too. Okay, so I'm gonna put my tools here. Oh my god. Bruh. What is going on with this today? Lately, it's been doing this a lot, hasn't it? Not even just today. So annoying. Okay. Uh, that and we'll put this in here too because that is also good to have in here just in case we get stuck in the nether or some shit because you never know happened last time it can happen again happen to me it can happen to you Oh my god. Bruh. What the actual fuck? Ah, oh, this computer sometimes is spare. This internet sometimes. Hello, sirs. How are you doing today? I'm sure you love that you can't use your beds. It's great, isn't it? You want two books and quills for one emerald. Are you are you a psycho? <laughs> huh? A fortune one book. I wonder what that book is. I'll never know. He still got his mending enchantment, right? He never lost it. Okay. I was about to say. Please, no. Oh, right. We got the, we got the netherite. We got to do that, too. I forgot about that. Should I do armor first, do you think? Or should I do weapons? I feel like my sword could use it. Also, I want to put mending on my sword because that's the only thing that it's missing. Oh my god, if this music cuts out one more time, I'm going to lose it. That is so annoying. <sighs> I need... Gold? Right? I think... Bro, I might as well just leave the fucking music off if it's gonna keep doing this, like... <laughs> yeah... See, I don't want to do that one because we- I still want to add more efficiency to it. Like, I'd like to make it efficiency 5. Um, I don't think we have another efficiency book, though. Bro, Why? Why is it doing this to me? Efficiency 3. I don't think that'll do it. I think it has to be at least the same or better. Or maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Yeah, it has to be better 
See, I don't really want to do my pickaxes, so I guess we could just do a piece of our armor, which probably... Probably... I don't want to do it until we get it fully enchanted. See, that's the problem. So maybe I will do the pickaxe. Nah, you want know fuck it. We're doing the boots. We're doing it. We're, do we're doing the fucking boots. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, can it stop doing that now, please? It's not gonna stop this. It's just gonna do this the whole night. We could make some uh, more shelter boxes. Just trying to think of things that we need to do that we haven't done in a while. Bruh. I don't know how many we can make. 13. Dang. Dang. That's a lot. <sighs> oh, you know what we need to make? You know what we need to make? That too. Oh my god. Is that not the most annoying thing ever? The music cutting out? Bro. Bro. Okay. It annoys shit out of me. <laughs> A jukebox. We didn't have a jukebox. Okay. Do we have any dyes that we could use? Any flowers? We do have flowers outside. I just mean for the shulker boxes. I do want to make a chorus fruit farm too eventually, but not right now. Um, um, uh, oh, we do have cocoa beans, but we don't have anything to grow them on. Um, we don't have any cactus. We do have blue, but, like, I don't want more blue. I guess what I could do is just put these um, in a chest somewhere. Like, right here. I'm just trying to think of, like, random small errands that we can do, because we need to run a few errands, hey? And what I'm thinking is we'll do a few signs for, like, labeling these chests. As well as some of these item frames. I feel like item frames are more useful. Got any more, aren't I? I was thinking signs and I was like, no, that's stupid, Kyle. Uh, where's a really shit book? That's the shit book. There we go. There's nothing in that one. Or that one. Well, I won't put anything there yet.
This is armor. This is weapons. This is horse armor. And this is saddles. So nice doing this. I don't know why. It's just... This is so chill. Amethyst. Okay, we need more wood. More wood. Um. Like, stream's almost over. Like, that's crazy. I feel like we just started. Didn't it? Unlike last night where everything went horribly wrong and <laughs> didn't go by fast at all. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. organize actual blocks yet so I guess this is what we're doing um and this is just random items so what's a good thing I could put in the item frame for just items that doesn't go there also neither does that maybe just like a piece of string It was. It was good to test things, for sure. As frustrating as it turned out. <laughs> I keep forgetting that we have end rods, too. It's the thing we need to use. Okay, this is just, like, items. And this here is that. And this is shulker boxes. More item frames. There one there. And yeah, like everything is pretty much labeled now. Need to do up here too. So, I will take out one of these, and one of these. And we'll put another one over here, just in case. Like that. What is this? This is random items. It's an extra map of the house. Um, and this is like... Our first stuff. This is like firsts. Okay. Okay. Throw this map in here. And we'll put those items back in there. Um. I will take this shield because we do we should have something equipped besides because we don't have a totem or nothing so you know you know
trees that have grown back since I cut a lot of them down. There we go. What this one? This one change? I don't think so. That's where the end portal is. Okay, so the music's working now all of a sudden, like. So annoying. Um yeah. Okay. I do wish the creeper farm was working a little bit better than it is. That would be nice. It was working quite well, and then all of a sudden it was just like, nah, I don't really want to work that well. I feel like it's because it's too light up here. Like, I feel like if we closed it in, it'd probably work better. Maybe. Maybe not. What do you think? Do you think it would be better if we closed it in? Hmm? What? Hmm? Hmm? I said, do you think it would be better if we enclosed this in something? Like if we put walls around it, like we did on the other one. What do you think, Skelly? It does, but... I don't know, see, because I haven't done, like, a full-on test with this one. Like, I haven't I haven't went AFK on this one like I have on... Because the other one, I used to go AFK uh, before I stream, right? To get a bunch of gunpowder. So let's just wait here for a couple minutes, I guess, and see again. It seems to be working fine now. I think it has to do with nighttime and the lighting, so I think if we had the walls, it would work better. Because it's raining right now, which means it's dark. Right, and we already had to respawn. I'm not going to do it now, but it, you know what I mean. I feel like we could do it the same way. Probably use tinted glass again. Only problem is we don't have access to an amethyst crystal like we did. The geode on the other world is so OP. I haven't seen another one that big. Like, ever. It's the biggest amethyst geode I've ever found. Why does it stop raining? It stops snowing when I go out here. <laughs> when I go over here, it's snowing again. I go out here and it stops again. That's so weird. Four minutes later. Let me speed run getting all that. I don't know. I don't know. I always forget about this village. I always see it, but I still forget about it. Like, are they even, like, alive anymore? I guess so. Oh, a cat. A kitty.
I have an idea. Should make it look like a Rubik's cube. That would be just, that's an interesting concept. Do fish eat cooked fish or raw fish? Do you remember? Cause I don't. I feel like it's raw fish. I'm pretty sure. Simmons. Oh, did they not drop them in because they're little? Is that the idea? Why are there so many squid in this river? This is not a river. <laughs> Oh, he did trap one. Hello, fishy, 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 fishy. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Hello? Hello? Oh, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. You die. 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 Stop swimming away from me. It's time to die. Bruh. One spam under there. He thought he could get away. That's what he thinks. Thank God I'm playing on bedrock so I can get big salmon. <laughs> Clearly, all the Java players are jealous of big salmon. That's what I hear every time that I hear Java players talk about Minecraft and the versions. They're always like. You know what? I wish I had bedrock because then I could have big salmon. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Kitty, kitty, come, kitty, come, kitty. There it is. Hello. Hello there. Would you like this? Would you like a fish? You would like fish, fish? Fish, fish, yes. No, no fish fish. Let's come here. Is the shield the shield scare you? Oh come on. Stop fighting it. You know you want it. You know you want my salmon. Yummy yummy fresh salmon just killed. Oh. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Come on, kitty. I want more than one. I like kitties. Will you teleport to me if I... If we go down here, because... I don't want you to fall and hurt yourself. Is there any more of your friends around? Here, kitty. <laughs> no. You have no friends? Okay, well. We shall leave then. You should be teleporting behind me. Yeah, okay. 
They don't teleport as well as dogs do. That's why I, I ask. Oh, the music's cutting out again. Classic. Still behind me? What should I name you? Hmm. Hmm. Should I name you? Psst, 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 psst. There's a beehive here? Oh, I'm gonna steal that. Kitty? Oh, there you are. Okay. I was like, damn, I thought I died. I was about to get sad. Um, we need another beehive because one of the bees here doesn't have an actual place to live. There you go. Now you do. Come hither, kitchen. You know how people say, I always thought about this, you know how people have like, there's a cat and kitten, right? And a kitten is a baby cat, right? Sit, sit. You're not eating him. Be good. Um, what if, what if a teenage cat, like in between kitten and cat, was a catten? Right, right. Come on, you're going upstairs. Yes, you're going upstairs, come on. Can you change their collar too? I think you'd be cool if you had a blue collar as well. I know I'm going over the time right now. Uh, uno momento. If you don't mind. I'm gonna name you. Jelly bean. I don't know why. Just feel like you're a jelly bean. And that's where we're gonna end stream. It's a good spot to end stream. Okay, so thank you for watching. I appreciate it. I'll be on again tomorrow night, and maybe we'll do some testing tomorrow night before we actually do a full stream. <laughs> Woo! Ugh. Yeah, thank you for watching, and uh, I'll be on tomorrow night. We'll be doing retro again because we're going to try and do some stuff. It might not be retro. I don't know. I just want to do something with the capture device. Anyways, bye-bye!